Hi guys, I just had an H&M order arrive and I wanted to get this video filmed for you. If you hear Milo in the background, he's having his lunch in the other room. Just, you know, the conservatory. It's not like I've just left him in another room. Um, and I wasn't camera ready at all. I was not prepared to film. He's already had his nap. The time that I normally would film has gone, has <laughs> already been and gone. Um, but because this arrived, I really wanted to film it because if you make videos or do blog posts or whatever else, I'm sure you will know that if you don't film it straight away, then oftentimes you just forget that you got the stuff and then you never make the video. And I know you guys do enjoy hauls, so here is what I got from H&M. First of all, they actually made a really random error. Um, I ordered some pumps, some like white pumps, really basic, but they had kind of like a sports mesh overlay. And it does say, I'm looking for the thing that they sent in return or instead. Um, they have like a really nice mesh overlay and I've been wanting to get some white converse for a while. I've got some grey high tops. I don't wear them very often, they're difficult to put on and I don't want to spend like 40 something pounds and then never wear them. So I bought these white ones in the sale on H&M and it does say on my kind of little delivery slip thing that they arrived but they didn't and I don't really know how to complain about it. It's a bit strange but I'm going to find an email address online and tell them that they made a mistake because I do want them. They weren't particularly cheap, I think they were £7 the ones that I ordered but they look so cute and I'm hoping they've still got them. But instead of sending what I ordered they sent me these rings. Totally different thing, really strange. I like them but I didn't order them and they're not shoes. Bit strange so I thought I'd get that one out of the way first of all. I also did, ordered another pair of shoes, these were, are we calling these copper? I think we are. They're kind of almost like a sparkly pink, but I guess copper. They looked more copper online. And they are these. And they are super comfortable. I've already been wearing them today. I'm wearing them in and I may wear them to IMAX at the weekend. If you're gonna be there, I'm gonna be there on a Saturday. If you see me, come and say hello. I'm so excited. As I film this now, it's Monday, but I think it's gonna go up on Friday. So tomorrow I will be in London with Laura from Laura Loves Beauty X and a friend of mine. And we are so excited for a little girls weekend in London, but we will only be in IMAX for that Saturday, so. Very excited, never been before, but if you do see us, come and say hello because we will be just as nervous as anybody else. I hate approaching people and much as it is a bit nerve wracking to be approached, I'd much rather kind of say hello to people than not. I'd really be disappointed if I kind of came away and not met anybody that I wanted to meet, that I watched their videos and someone said, oh, I saw you but I didn't want to say hello. That would be really disappointing. I, I, the whole point of going to IMAX for me is to meet other people that love beauty and blogging and YouTube as much as I do. Not the actual shopping so much, but I can't say that I won't be shopping, so there will be another haul probably next week. But anyway, these. Um, these are kind of like day to night pumps, I think. You could probably get away with wearing them on an evening out, um, kind of that smart casual look, and I may wear them for mats because if they are that comfy, they're definitely kind of walking around London during the day and then maybe party at night. Very, very, very much liking those, and they were five pounds in the sale. Anything that I haul in this video, I will try to link below or in a blog post if I can. Um, argan oil with body butter. No, body butter with argan oil. They had a whole range of stuff, like a scrub and another kind of lotion in a pump. Uh, and everything's gone in the sale now, so if it's good, it's worth trying for like a fraction of the price that it was. I think everything's about half price. Really wanted to try it before. Ooh, the baby. Anyway, there were loads of things from the with argan oil range that I wanted to try. This was one of them, so I got them for three pounds instead of maybe five, I think it might have been. I don't know, but this was three pounds in the sale anyway. It doesn't smell amazing, but I'm looking forward to trying it because I'm thinking it's gonna be really nourishing. Uh, this makeup bag was an absolute steal. It was two pounds. I wanted it full price. Funny story, actually, I went online the day before the sale hit and none of the things that I was looking for were there. I'd been umming and ahhing about some purchases and I thought, you know what? I'll go and get them. Any coupon codes that I've got, by the way, I'll link below, because uh, I did have some coupon codes and I thought, well, I'm just gonna go and buy the things that I want. Uh, but they weren't there, and I, I don't know if it's like they can't sell something at full price within a certain amount of hours before they're gonna be kind of discounted by a certain amount, but they just weren't anywhere, and all of a sudden they were 50% off the next day, so I would have been pretty pissed off if I'd bought them and then the next day they'd have been half price. Um, so maybe that's why, but I got this and I was gonna buy this for full price, so I'm really pleased to have got it for two pounds. It's actually totally flexible. I thought it was gonna be one of those um, makeup bags that held its shape. Milo's just by the side of me now wondering, he's like, why am I not in that? Why am I not on the, on the screen right now? Is that right? Um, yeah, but I thought it was gonna be one of those that, like molded that held its shape, but it's not. So it's gonna be totally flexible uh, and it's gonna fit a lot more stuff in it. So when I do my what's in my bag video very, very soon with everything that I'm taking with me to London, you will see this, no doubt. Um, another random thing that I got, boxer shorts, not for me, 
Although I may steal a pair when we do go away. I don't have any kind of summery pajamas. I feel like it's gonna be really warm. It's so hot today, it's really humid. As soon as I finish filming this video, I'm taking all of my makeup off. I'm putting kind of shorts and t-shirt on because it's so, so warm in my house right now. Uh, but these are for Lee. They were in the sale, I think they were seven pounds and he likes his kind of fancy looking boxer shorts. I just, thank you. Thank you so much. Do you want that back? Thank you. Um, He's just passing me things. Yeah, he really, really likes uh, box shorts that are kind of like patterned and colourful and stuff like that. For Father's Day, I got him some stripy diesel ones. Uh, and yeah, they'll, they'll be his best pants. Anybody else's boyfriend slash husband have best pants? Because mine does. So they were for, oh baby, okay. They were for Lee. I'm getting further and further away as Milo knocks the camera. Uh, two more things from H&M. Oh, are you coming up now? You want to be in the video? <laughs> Because as soon as we film the video, he knows where we're going. Yeah. I can't leave the chair right now because I'm filming a video. Is that okay? Yeah. Can we do that afterwards? Yeah. Yes. Just afterwards, I'll just two more minutes. Anyway, um, I'm getting so warm. This little khaki vest top. I don't know whether or not this was in the sale or not. Uh, let me see. Let me see how much this was. Do, 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 do. Three pounds. I think it probably was in the sale. Um, but it just looks a little bit prettier than a regular vest top. Um, and I actually might wear this under kind of like a blazer or something on Saturday. And I got something for Lee that was absolutely not in the sale, but I got so many discount codes on it that it was like, I don't know how much I paid for it in the end. I think I ended up getting £5 plus 25% off. I think I paid £12 or something for it. I think it's supposed to be 19 99 But this cute jumper, he hasn't got any jumpers. And we're going to go to New York in January, and it just seemed appropriate. And if he doesn't wear it, I will definitely wear it. Lastly, I did pick up a few things from Boots um, a couple of weeks ago. Milo's being so funny. Do you want to just be in the video, dude? Do you want to just sit there and say hello to everyone? Because you're looking at the thing like, why can't I see myself in that picture? Do you want to just say hello to them while I get this stuff? Um, yeah, I picked up a few more bits and pieces that I haven't hauled. Will you hold that for me? That would be great. Um, and one of them is the Dove Hair Therapy, and I got this on so many of your recommendations. I said that I wanted a, what did I say, leave-in conditioner, and so many of you said, get the yellow bottle Dove. And it is amazing. It does the job of a leave-in conditioner and an oil. Haven't used any of my hair oil since I've had it. It smells amazing. It smells like, just so good. It smells really kind of fruity and sweet, and really like, are you trying to open something? I really like holidays. It's just so so good and my hair has felt so amazing and it just looks really good with it in uh, and you can also use it on dry hair which was what really swung it for me he's desperately trying to open an eye pencil and it's going to really annoy him in a minute when he can't do it it's even difficult for me so you know he's not going to be able to do it um but this was really really good so thank you so much for those of you that did recommend that to me i also picked up this recently which i think has already been in another video but i haven't hauled it yet it's the enchanted wonderstruck by taylor swift love this not as much as the original are you saying hello? Are you waving? Are you saying hello? Yes, that's you. Well done. Um, the Enchanted Wonder Struck, it's really nice. It's different to the original. It's more warm and vanilla-y, whereas the other one was sweet and fruity. I like it, but it's different. You can't really compare the two. And I prefer the other one. Okay. Um, but I do prefer the other one, but this is nice as well. Um, what else do we have? The soap and glory one heck of a lot, you know that I have. I also got the MUA uh, BB cream that I don't have with me, but they, you know, kind of silly to uh, haul them since you know that I tried them out recently. Where are you going now? Uh, but I do really, really like this, and I think it's probably going to be in my favourites for the month. Uh, and lastly, I picked up the Rimmel Scandalize eyeshadow stick in, what colour is this? Bulletproof Beige, thank you. And this is nice, but it kind of... I'll show you like that while I'm holding the tripod. Um, it, it's kind of disappointing. It's a little bit streaky. I'm not as impressed with it as I thought it was going to be. Um, yeah, I think I want to try the bronzy one, the darker one than this. It's, it's nice, don't get me wrong. I mean, you can see it on my hand there. It's a nice kind of golden shade, but when you blend it out, it doesn't blend out as nicely as I'd like. Like, it goes a little bit patchy. So unless you put it on full strength, in which case it's going to crease and kind of smear, then it does look a bit funny when you blend it out. So not ideal, not exactly what I thought it was going to be, and it does say that it's waterproof and budge proof and whatever else, 24 hours, which I don't think that it is, but yeah. So I do like that, 
but I have my kind of bug bears with it and I'm gonna try, try some more from the range. But if you've got any recommendations of particular colors then let me know. Uh, but that's it for this haul. Sorry if uh, the baby bugged you, but he's around a lot. You know, what are you gonna do? But I will see you guys in my next video and I will have lots of IMATS related ones probably next week. Bye.